Hello, I just thought I'd upload another reflection for you this Friday. You know, as I'm sat at home here, as most of you are, pretty much all of you, I'm kind of looking out the window around the neighbourhood and it's very, very peaceful. But did you know the Bible said that as Christians, we are allowed to have this type of peace within at all times, free from worry and free from anxiety. Yes, we really are. John 14, 27 says, my peace I leave with you, my peace I give you. I don't give you as the world gives. Don't let your hearts be troubled and don't be afraid. Now, that's pretty good news. Um, back in the 1500s, there was a man called Nicholas Ridley who was sentenced to be burnt at the stake. A woman called Lady Jane Grey, um, along with her colleagues, ruled London with an iron fist and didn't like anybody who was propagating the true gospel, which is what Nicholas Ridley was doing. He was sentenced to be burnt at the stake in the morning. Now, if anything, that's going to take your peace away. But not Nicholas, no, because his brother said to him, can I stay with you in the cell tonight to keep you company and give you peace? Nicholas said, I've already got company. I spend much time with my Lord Jesus. He has given me peace and I will sleep soundly tonight. And he did. He slept soundly because of the peace God gave him um, in his heart. Now, you might, not, you might not be facing the type of persecution that Nicholas Ridley faced, um, but you're probably going through tough times at the moment because of the situation around us with coronavirus. But I want to say to you today two things. Number one, does God want peace for you? Yes, absolutely. Can, and number two, can you have peace within today? Yes, absolutely. Colossians 3.15 says, Let the peace of Christ rule in your hearts, since as members of one body you were called to peace. And be thankful. So I want to bless you with that today. God bless you and um, we'll see you soon.